Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. We'd love to show you what we've done to our Land Rover 110 station wagon over the last few months. In case you didn't see what it looked like before, we've thrown the picture in the video as well as a link in the comments. We've done a complete overhaul of the outside. We've done a Raptor liner on the outside, new windows, roll cage, bumpers, uh, LED lighting, everything. We'd love to show you in this video. Here are some pictures of the car before the build. You'll find a link to the walk around video in the comments. We put on off-road tires on the 18-inch Defender 1983 wheels from Khan. One of the new Explore glazing windows has the Overlander light panel, which we can use to mount different kinds of accessories on. On the other side, we have a gullwing window with an external window guard for easy access for whatever we need inside of the car. As you see, we fitted the safety device's six-point roll cage, as well as the safety device's snorkel. We fitted all new hinges with grease nipples for longevity and to prevent corrosion. We're very happy with the Raptor liner coating we've applied to the whole car. The finish and color look great and it will offer us a lot of protection. On top of the roll cage we'll be mounting a rooftop tent, a solar panel, a light bar and spotlights on the side. The entire car has all new LED lighting, new protective grills as well as a winch mount bumper. The winch will be installed within the next few months. New checker plates and air vent grills were also installed. In the rear we added a rear view camera to work with our Kenwood multimedia system. We also fitted a large spotlight and more lights will be added later. New rock sliders were fitted to protect the car as well as to revamp the look. On top we installed a marine grade cable gland where we can run all the wires to the outside accessories from one central point and not have to worry about water. I hope you enjoyed the video, stay tuned for our inside rebuild.